<clears throat> right, let's see if this is working. Okay, so it looks like we are live on YouTube. Um, I don't know how that, uh, this is my first time doing this YouTube one. So my, my worry is, is it was supposed to be all set up so that I'd have chat working through Streamlabs. But my guess is it's not hooked up there. Let's see. Uh, yeah, because it has, it has Twitch Prime in there. That's not right. If you're watching, give me just a hello in the chat and so I can see if uh, so I can see if it's working with the Streamlabs OBS. My guess is that it's not because I see Twitch Prime next to my name in the chat. Which is annoying, but I don't think it's impossible to actually do this. Uh, I know what I'll have to do. It won't be hard. It won't be hard. Just give me a sec. Give me one second. All right. <clears throat> Works. Oh, so thank you for chatting hello. Let me take a look to see if it's in my Streamlabs. That would make it a lot easier if it was. Oh, please, please, please. Nope, nope, it's not. Of course it's not. That's fine. Should be able to get the chat up on my Twitch really quick. I mean, I mean on my Kindle. Mm -hmm. Have I really never used YouTube on my Kindle? This is embarrassing. Uh, how's the sound? Do you guys hear good sound? What is going on? Is my screen broken? There we go. It's very possible that I'm just going to have to cancel this and go over to Twitch. If I can't get the chat to show up on my typical way of uh, 
viewing this stuff. There we go. We're almost there. We are almost there. I've got, I feel it's coming. Which I'm really surprised that there's anybody able to find me on YouTube gaming considering I've, I don't think I've ever actually streamed on here. And I'm having a hard time finding myself. Like, you'd think I'd just be able to go to my own channel and it would show me my live stream. But not the case. Cool. I found it. Found it, found it, found it. Chat. Okay, there it is. Oh, please! Ah, right when I got to the chat, I see the like four chat messages on there. And then it's like, you've got to sign in. I don't, I don't need to sign in. I just want to read the chat. I'm going to be a voyeur of the chat. I'll talk to the chat. Ah, I got anxiety problems. Sometimes I get really angry, really upset. Is it listed as comments or is it listed as chat? Okay. There we go. Pop out chat. That's even better. Come on. I mean, I can taste it now. I can tell we are about to be in action. I don't know if you can see this, but I have this weird, like, thing that clamps it onto a table. And then I should be able to... No, don't power off. The problem is, as wonderful as the technology is, they weren't thinking about a Kindle when they built this thing. Because in order to clamp it, it clamps onto the power button. You hold the power button down for two, three seconds, and it wants to shut it down. <sighs> Why do bad things happen to good people, right? I'm sure that's what everybody's thinking right now. Like, look at this. Look at this, this, this hero on screen having to deal with chat not loading up. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Mm. What is happening? I mean, I know, I understand. It's got to be disappointing to just see this on the screen. It's so soon. I guess I should have downloaded the Kindle app for this. Press start. I don't want to press start. Oh, and now it's going to make me like go through, like, what's your favorite games? Today's not the day I want to go through your, your tutorial. Just give me the chat. I Can't you tell I'm live? You'd think there'd be some sort of, like... It's saying go live. I am live already. Just go to my own channel. Very soon.
part of the problem is, is this Kindle is only like two years old and it's as good as broken. The thing never really worked that good. It works great for reading books, but if you're trying to do anything else, you might as well just put it in the toilet. Is it possible they're not live anymore? Oh, here we are. Here we are. Back to it. Okay, now let's pause this. That's paused already. <coughs> Try popping out that chat one more time. Restore chat. Uh, life, life is going pretty good. Life is going pretty good. It doesn't, you know, obviously, it doesn't go without its own frustrations. But uh, I'm safe from the fires, which are not that far away. I don't know if you happen to see the um, the last break news break special. There's there was fires. You could go out to the beach and see flames roaring uh, across the mountain and smoke just coming in off the ocean. It was wild. Uh, it's allegedly possible that it'll get worse again tonight and tomorrow because the Santa Ana winds are picking back up. But the hope is, wow, that got loud quick. Uh, the hope is that uh, they have contained it enough that it's not going to go crazy. So how was that? Was that noise way too loud? Let's see. Maybe I'll bring this down a little bit. And I'll drop the volume in here down. We're just going to continue this game. I don't know if you... I don't even remember when the last time I played uh, this game was, but... I was disappointed in the fact that the game doesn't play in the same way as like Fallout Vegas or Fallout 3 where your own character has no voice, you're like Skyrim, so that you could like, in essence, uh, vicariously live through the character. This character has its own voice. What's going on here? Seven hours. There's no way I was playing this for seven hours. Let's just give it a... Museum of Freedom. This, I know where this is at. This is when I first uh, come across the people in the museum and they need help. I don't know if it's before or after a big fight. Cool. I think I have everything. Unfortunately, my chat is this tiny little window on a fairly small uh, screen being a Kindle and I have a lot more of screen I've just got a paused video I'd like to just be able to have the video disappear and have the letters of the chat be nice and big but whatever I'm not gonna waste any more of your time my time we're moving forward Oh, well, thank you for my... We are definitely fine. My family help and us. I, my wife, we'll help you. we're far enough away that we won't have any problems with the uh, with the fires. Oh, I'm in the power armor, but it's weird. It's very, very invisible. All right, let's...
let's see what happens now. Have you gotten a chance to play? Has anybody watched and played Fallout 4? I haven't heard anybody say anything too bad about it. My my uh, problems with it are pretty nitpicky, and I understand that not everybody has the same expectations from a game to have no main character voice. I mean, that's pretty specific to be annoyed with. This looks pretty good. I've been playing Fallout New Vegas, the modded version. I don't know if you realize this, maybe you guys haven't noticed, but Gamefront is back uh, up and running, not the same as it used to be, but I've been playing the modded version of Fallout New Vegas, which is Fallout New California, and that has been a lot of fun. I think I, I mean, we should be good to go. No more core power, but it's okay. I shouldn't really need much more core power. Well, hi there, Michael Doom. Or Doan. Sorry. Doan. It's very small text. It looked like it said Doom. Michael Doom. Sounds like an evil villain's character. Or, at the very least, a uh, chaotic good vigilante. Guys, it's gonna be okay now. Yeah, for a while anyway. We can at least move some. Listen, when we first met, you said we owed you for helping us out. I guess you've earned it. So here. It may not be a chest full of emeralds, but it'll have to do. Cool, fusion cell. I wonder if I can use that to power my power armor. I didn't do it for money. Hey, sorry. I'm used to everyone being in it only for themselves. You know, you remind me of my friends, the other men and men, the ones who gave their lives for something bigger than themselves. You should come with us to Sanctuary. We could use the help. All right, Garvey, I'm in. Oh, that's wonderful. But there's more to your destiny, isn't there? This lady's I've creepy. I've seen it. And I know your pain. Go on. Okay. I'm listening. <laughs> See, I like to be the voice of the guy saying these hope. things. But all's not lost. I can feel your son's energy. He's alive. I'm listening. Look, kid, I know how I sound. The sight, it's weird. And it ain't always clear. But your son's out there. And even I don't need the sight to tell you where you should start looking. The great green jewel of the Commonwealth. Diamond City. The biggest settlement around. All right. Well, then I'll head to Diamond City. What's in Diamond City? Is Sean there? Look, kid. I'm tired now. Maybe you'll bring me some chems later. The site will paint a clearer picture. No. Mama Murphy, we talked about this. That jump. It's gonna kill you. Ah, shush, Preston. Uh. We're all gonna die eventually. We're gonna need the site. And our new friend here, he's gonna need it too. Now let's get going. Sanctuary awaits. All right, folks. Thanks to our friend here, it's safe to move out. We're heading for that place Mama Murphy knows about. Sanctuary. It's not far. She knows about it? You mean she had one of her visions while she was stoned out of her gourd? And now you want us to just head out on another wild goose chase based on no better plan than Mama Murphy saw it? It can hardly oh, hold turn on, out hold any on. worse than... Everybody just take it easy. We're all in this together, right? So Marcy, you got a better idea of what we should do next? Anybody? Well then, sanctuary it is. Let's just hope it lives up to its name. Come on, June. It's time to go. Oh. All right, hold on. 
three things. First of all, yes, I'm still playing music. Oddly enough, on such a rare occasion, sometimes years between, I, I did play a music show in August uh, with somebody I used to play music with a long time ago. I don't think I have any copies of the music, sadly. Um, but I'm still playing. I'm not making any new music. I should be. Uh, then secondly, just as a quick roundup of what's happening in the game, because it sounds like there's a couple people that are have not have not played this before. Uh, the game opens. It's before the nuclear war, before Fallout's world starts as we know it, uh, like post-apocalypse. And somebody sells you an invitation to join a vault. You get into the vault with your with your kid, your son, and your wife. Um, and then as you're getting frozen, you freeze and time passes you don't really know exactly how long and then you wake up in a freeze and they're taking the baby from your wife you can't do anything about it because you're half frozen and then she gets shot and killed and then you freeze back again then one day everything's broken you break out and like there's skeletons on the ground you don't know how long you've been frozen for but your son's gone you're hoping to find him out in the wasteland you break yourself out you see your robot friend that you had as as the world was normal before the nuclear war and he suggests you go here because there's people we find these people they're being attacked by raiders guy like me can protect them and I did. And there was also a death claw, which was a pretty hard fight. So that's that's you catching up on the story. Uh, I've been a fan since 2011. Thank you for liking my work. I don't know if you guys have heard. There's a little splash screen on the bottom. It says uh, Twitch on there. And then sometimes it flips over to Alchemy This. Alchemy This is a brand new podcast I'm doing uh, with Kevin Pollack, who you might know from... The uh, the usual suspects and the he was I mean, he's been in hundreds of movies and stuff. Um, in Marvelous Miss Maisel, he's in that. Uh, it's me and five other people, or well, me four other people and Kevin Pollock. Kevin Pollock's a people. Well, he's a person. It's it's a really fun show. I hope you guys check it out. It's on everywhere you'd get a, a podcast. Um, but if you get it on Apple and you give it a rating, that would be a huge favor to me. It's, uh, <laughs> we were, we were listed, we had one of the episodes, we've only been out for less than a month, one of the episodes was number 15 in comedy, uh, apparently the, the, in itself is a pretty big celebration, Alchemy This, the podcast, in general, uh, ranked 35th on podcasts, and so it's doing really well. Uh, I'd really love it if you guys would check that out. Let's get out into the wasteland. Oh, here's the third thing I wanted to do. The graphics don't look that good to me. They're way better than um, what you get in Fallout New Vegas or Fallout the other one. But it's just so washed out. Is it do, I, do I have the brightness too high? Pip Boy color. Oh, that's HUD color. I don't need to change the HUD. Let's see. Object fade, actor fade. The brightness is so bright that everything looks washed out. can be up footsteps radio we're gonna have to drop unfortunately as much as i love fallout now this is the first time i've streamed on uh youtube just testing it out uh, maybe that's a lie if i have streamed on youtube it was a long time ago um but i'm worried that they're gonna, with us sanctuary. they're gonna hit me with some sort of copyright flag because the music in this game is you know Sturgis. great music Uh, I do keep in touch with Mitch. I just was at Mitch's wedding about a month ago. He got married. Uh, it was fantastic. Uh, I mean, I don't want to say much about anything else, but there, it's Mitch is doing great. He is doing fantastic. Super proud of him. Uh, I'm crossing my fingers that there is a shorter distance between us somehow that we can get together and game more often. Zach, I called today, uh, and I talked to him. He's doing good. He's looking for a new place to live. Um, Let's move out. in Hawaii. At least, I actually, I didn't ask. Maybe he's looking for a place to live in California. That'd be awesome. Uh, and I was going to see if he wanted to stream with me, but he's busy. He's watching, I guess, his nephew. 
And um, yeah, so that's how they're doing. What, what other questions was there? Uh, I'm I'm desperately trying to redo a Dark Souls walkthrough again. Uh, Zach and I had talked about ways that we could do it. The problem is, and I don't. It's not like I'm trying to be stingy with my Dark Souls play, but I don't want to do it by myself. It's not the same. There has to be the camaraderie, the side coaching. It, it helps uh, add so much more to the, the experience than just watching one person crush through it, and. So the last I talked was to Zach uh, about possibly a cap stash. Ooh. About possibly doing a co-op style walkthrough of, of Dark Souls, especially the new remaster one. They make it so... I've heard. I haven't figured it out yet. <gasps> I don't want to get out because I'm out of power. Well, hopefully I can keep up with these guys. Because I want to keep this power armor at the next place. If I leave it behind, I'm never going to be able to take it again. Um, but my guess was, and, and I've pitched to this idea a couple times and not sold on it yet one way or the other. But we're thinking either A, we do a walkthrough co-op where Zach can completely just, w if somebody dies, we go back and we get the person, we go forward after that. Um, like if it was in a boss fight though, you would just finish the boss fight, win or lose. If you're out of it, then you'd go back, get that person back alive, uh, and make a playthrough. So the other option would be that he would join in, but he would best. never, I'm going to have to drop this thing off. This of thing's got to hold A to exit. It sucks. But, uh, so maybe I should mark where this is. I'll never remember. It's just not going to happen. So the other thing, the other option would be that he would join in and can't do anything except protect himself and does not aggressively attack any other enemies. And the fourth and final one is that uh, he literally doesn't even protect himself. He just runs from any enemies that are there and takes no, um, no attacks. My, th my guess is the easier version of it would be that we just do a co-op walkthrough of it. And obviously, we're not going to have 500 deaths for that. That'd be too easy. Uh, 250 would be the amount if we're doing a co-op. So what do you think of those things? Well, look at that. I think I just found my new vacation home. Your idea of heaven, eh, There just could be some good salvage in there. Let's get to Sanctuary first, though. I think we're close. So here's the other thing is that every time I look at the chat, I feel like I'm just showing the top of my head. So I'm going to try to move this up a little. Oh, oh. Ah. Wouldn't it be great if as I'm leaning over, it's just like pop, 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 pop into Mama Murphy's head. Oh, gosh. It's just like the good old days. Oh. Let's see. We got it. Okay, got it, got it. Guys, wait up for me. So the graphics do look good. It's just everything seems so pastel. Like, what is it? Easter weekend, 24 hours a day? Give me some sharp colors, some dark, gritty, earthy tones. This looks good. Well, I'll be damned. The monuments of the original Minutemen. I knew that was somewhere around Concord. That means this right here must be the Old North Bridge, where the first shots of the American Revolution were fired. I'd call that the best omen I've seen since we left Quincy. Yeah, I don't know what you're talking about, boss, but I'm glad you're happy about it. <sighs> I don't know. What do you guys think of the graphics? Are they good? Am I being too picky? I mean, that water looks good. But look at my skin. Look at everybody's skin. I'm glad you like, look how pa pasty it is. I should have is. listened to Mama Murphy all along. Pretty nice place she's found for us. I think we could settle down here. Make it a place to call home. What do you think? Uh, listen, I lived yeah. here. I used to like living here. 
before the war. What do you mean? Before what war? Are you saying... I lived here over 200 years ago. I was frozen or something for most of it. Just woke up a little while ago. Damn. Like one of those old pre-war ghouls. You say you were frozen. Anybody else make it out with you? My son. Somebody took him while I was still trapped. Have you run across anybody with a baby boy? Damn. <laughs> I'm sorry. Anybody but with a baby no, boy? Is it that uncommon I haven't run across any now? kidnapped babies. I'll definitely keep an eye out for him. Anyway, I am glad you're here. And I hope you don't mind, but I've got another favor to ask. Another? Had word from a settlement asking for help. There's still hope in there, Minute Man out there, somewhere. The only chance to start rebuilding the Minute Man is to show people that they can count on us when they need us. Trouble is, I've got my hands full here. Do you think you could go help out the settlement? Mm. What kind of help do they need? Sounded like the usual. Raiders. You'll have to get all the details when you talk to them. I'd be glad to help. That's fantastic. The men and men could use more people like you. By the way, if you want to help out around here at all, talk to Sturgis. I'm sure he'd be glad for all the help he can get. Okay. A frag grenades. That's nice. I really think I should have given this game a more fair shake. There's a few tiny complaints that I have, but overall, the world seems pretty immersive so far. This literally is the neighborhood that, in the beginning of the game, uh, the dog found something. What'd you find, buddy? Go get it! Over here. How you doing, buddy? <laughs> hey, boy. Think you can find something for me? See if there's any good stuff nearby, boy. Dog didn't... F he didn't look very far. I mean, that was the most weak look ever. Let's go. Yeah, we should be sitting each other for better dynamic. Uh, the problem is, is that that's like a huge issue. Uh, Mitch lives in San Francisco. Zach lives in Hawaii. It is borderline yes. impossible to actually do. Even if we we've had like a one one off where we get to get together and play some games, but to go through any game uh, in any length, it would be impossible. Dog found something, but. I don't, I don't like it. But we would probably have it where it was two cameras. Bubble gum. make sure I'm headed to the right thing. Uh, you know, let's see what it's like to play in third person view. I never play third person. First step, talk to the settlers at Ten Pines Bluff or go there. Let's do this first. Oops, and it is the thing that is on my record. Let's is there an easy way to cross? That bridge is pretty far. Am I going to get rads here? Yep! I'm not going in there. No way, Jose. But I might be able to jump across this. Oh, it was just that one spot that was getting me 10 rads a second. Uh, back to first person. It's 
So what what do you guys think of the quality of YouTube gaming streaming compared to Twitch? Is, do you think there's an advantage to one over the other? Uh, I just feel like in Twitch, I mean, I'm already getting more people viewing this one than on Twitch. I, I don't know. Maybe it's because I don't have as big a following on Twitch as I do on YouTube. But it doesn't seem... Um, it, it doesn't seem like it has the same draw. But I imagine it's got to probably be better, like delay between us seeing each other maybe better frame rate the graphics look better on twitch i don't know what's this Are these tunnels for death claws oh i've been here did i backtrack i think i did That's the, yeah, I totally backtracked because I wasn't paying attention. But the good news is, and now I'm going to be able to go get my power armor. I should see if I remember. It should be left right here, right? I wonder if I have any anything to put in there. No power. Ugh. Miscellaneous mods, ammo. So fusion cells what I was hoping I'd be able to. Oh, I can level up. I didn't level up. Let's do that. I, I do get confused with what these level ups are. Path to close us. I've already got that. Pistols do 20% more damage. I'll take it. Hmm. Well, yeah, I put it on Twitch sometimes, but it's just. I. I, I I've been traveling a lot, and trying to get time for gaming has been next to impossible, it seems. Um, but now I'm, I'm going to try to get back into it, try to get back into streaming more, playing more, making videos. I've been doing it, doing it for Gamefront has made me um, just miss it a little bit more, make me want to put a little extra time into it. Uh, if you haven't been watching, I did the the awesome. It is such an awesome mod. It's called New California, and it's a it's a complete overhaul of Fallout New Vegas. As long as you have Fallout New Vegas, it's completely free. But this, the graphics in this look way better. Do do like no surprise there, right? Look at this. Like they don't have anything like. Like this in there. Big, big. Well, I don't know if that's true. Hmm. This seems like a dangerous way to go down. Good. I was worried I was going to be taking too long of a drop. Break my legs. Gah! Let's see. Maybe it's easier to go around this way. Did it crash? My game just disappeared. Now let's see what it says here. Mitch, Zach, and I should start our own channel. I don't know if that would be even really possible. Uh, the problem, I wouldn't call it a problem. The blessing is 
Mitch works for IGN. I'd imagine if uh, during when we worked at Gamefront, we pretty much none of us worked on our own channels at that point in time. So it was never exclusively said, but it seems like it would be almost a conflict of uh, of interest to be doing your own gaming channels when you're trying to make uh, content for uh, something like that. Activate a circle. Circle. That thing doesn't even work. So I don't know, I haven't asked Mitch, but my gut would say that there could be a conflict of interest of like him starting his own channel. And uh, I'm a worrier. But my gut would say if I was in his position, I would be too worried about, um, you know, starting a second channel when you have an awesome thing going. Like why try to, why mix the pot up when you've got a, the stew is perfect already? Well, I guess you always want to mix the pot. I don't know. You know what I'm saying though, right? build that AP back up. Uh, I do like the changing of time. I think that the the day-night cycle looks pretty cool. I'm enjoying that. We're getting pretty close to the next area. What's this? <coughs> Whoops. Not what I meant to do. Wild mongrel. Okay, let's get some battle going. Got him! Don't necessarily think I need dog meat. I'm not at that state of desperation yet. Am I getting shot? Oh. One done. I do think, I, I don't know, Fallout New Vegas was really good. Because I, I, re I read that somebody said, their friend said Fallout New Vegas was the best of them. Uh, it had the best gameplay, I would argue. Um, Till I was blue in the face. I don't think anybody that says differently. Well, that's not counting this one, though. Uh, oh, those things are gross. But when you compare Fallout 3's gameplay to Fallout New Vegas' gameplay, it's just like they made huge improvements. Just simply being able to aim down scope, being able to cook stuff. That's the alpha dog. Got him. That, that dog had a bottle cap. Good for it. It was saving its money. Uh, the problem was, I really liked the idea of in Fallout 3, you begin the game as a baby. And you're crawling around. And you really feel like you can shape every piece of this kid's life as he goes through school, the friends he picks, then he leaves the vault... And you just really feel like you are invested in this character. Whereas, well, hello there. Hey there. What do you want? We Listen. don't need any more trouble around here. Didn't you ask the Minutemen for help? You're with the Minutemen? I didn't really think you fellas still existed. We sent word with one of them passing traders, But honestly, I never expected anything to come of it. Most people don't put much stock in the Minutemen these days. After Quincy. Bad business, that. We're rebuilding the Minutemen from the ground up. We're the good guys again. Glad to hear it. No question that things have been worse since the Minutemen fell to pieces. There's a raider gang that's been giving us trouble for weeks. Stealing food and supplies, threatening to kill us all if we don't pony up. We know where they're coming from, but we can't go up against a gang like that. Okay, kill the raiders. That sounds simple. I'll kick their asses for you. No problem. Thanks, friend. If you folks are for real this time, it'll be a welcome change for the better. Uh, in Fallout New Vegas, the difference is you start as a baby in Fallout 3. In Fallout New Vegas, on the other hand, you start as somebody that has like gotten a gunshot wound to the head, somehow miraculously survived with the help of a robot. Um, 
that saved your life. You're trying to piece back your memory together. So it's kind of like you get to create your past. This game, you don't get to... It's even further away from what I liked about Fallout 3's storyline. You're starting as a guy that has completely lived his whole life. You don't know what his past was like. Uh, but you do know... Well, here's some wild carrot flower. You, know, you do know what happens um, to him before the end of the world, really. I wonder if there's any full overhaul mods of this game. A feral ghoul. I don't know if I really want my dog attacking that feral ghoul. Whoa! I did not mean to do that. But, I'll take it. Man. There's a lot of ghouls. Is that thing still gonna try to crawl after us? So lucky with that shot there. Hmm. Way to go opening the door. Wait, where's my dog? better loot these characters here. Uh, this game is growing on me quite a bit. Most of the fans are from, uh, from the U.S. I don't know. I feel like it's pretty equal. There's a lot of people in the U.K. Uh, Her Knight says they're from Mexico. I I'm not going to call them a liar, but I thought that I heard they were from somewhere else. But not the U.S. Lucky this dog is taking all the the heat for me. Oh, he really did come at me. Okay, so I've made some mistakes. I've got to heal up. I didn't realize it's going into a damn zombie graveyard. Okay. Aid. Stim pack. I don't want to waste too much, so I think I'm going to just leave it at that. I forget, you know, it's been a while. Like, even though I've been playing Fallout New Vegas, I'm really slowly moving forward because I'm editing and, um... Oh. Oh my gosh, is she dead? Surveyor offer... Whoa, guys, sorry. I was not trying to do that. That's inappropriate. I took her clothes right off of her. But I, I forget, like, one of my favorite parts about Fallout in general, the first time I played it, like, all of a sudden, I'm in an area that is endgame enemies. Like, there are death claws out there, and they, I'm not prepared to fight them. But it's cool that you never know. There's not, like, a set, a set path that you have to go on. Let's just see what this computer's like.
oh wow, I got somebody from Italy, somebody from Mexico, somebody from Germany. So when uh, when I thought because you said you're from Mexico, I thought that I had read you say you were from Germany, uh, which is why I said that I didn't think that was the case. So what was the other thing? This wall thing is a joke, right? Uh, yeah, I mean, it's it's a joke, but only 50% of Americans are in on the joke. And the 50% that know it's just a joke don't even think it's a funny joke. They think it's a shitty joke. It's like listening to dead baby jokes. They're not good. They're not good. But yeah, I, I don't think that wall's ever going to happen. It's ridiculous and shameful. Uh, and if you're surprised that I'm getting political, well, then you're not paying attention, because I make a brief news brief show every day, and I don't try. I try to. I try to stay, you know, neutral. And sometimes I think neutral in itself is, you know, the logical thing is, is like, how can you be neutral and be like, well, uh, there's good sides and bad sides to building a wall. No, there's not. No, there's not. It's dumb. But I would say there's probably my hope, I cross my fingers, that it's like 49%, but it's damn close. There's like half of the people that think it's a good idea. Ah, oh, there goes my chat. <laughs> I'm gonna, it's, I'm gonna have to set that up better in the future. So here we are in Lexington. I think I've earned a second stim pack. I just don't want to waste it all. This must be the building I'm headed to, right? Hmm. Just gotta go around to get up the stairs, though. Oh, wait a second. This looks like a way better way of getting there. This looks a little familiar. glowing in here if I found some power oh glowing fungus that's great I'm gonna take some of that if I, I, I would like to get that power armor up and running but maybe it's cheap to have the power armor it seems like a little overpowered I might be wrong but I was able to one-on-one -on -one, yeah at a, like a level two character a death claw that shouldn't happen Super Duper Mart. Yeah, I've definitely been to a Super Duper Mart in Fallout 3. They probably have one in all of them, right? Let's see if we can get a headshot. Nice. I got lucky. Both those shots hit even though it was less than 50%. Oh, I don't know if lucky's the way to put it. Oh, I was able to hit a critical. That's the first time I've done that. I'm not quite even sure. Maybe I missed that part of the tutorial, or maybe it was just so long ago. How am I missing this guy? I will solve that. You okay, buddy? Well, I'm certainly not being quiet about this. Danger. What's still alive? Research test tube. Oh. 
this guy was not supposed to be dead. Well, I'll tell you what, that means I need to use one more of these and maybe even do some damage resistance. Psycho? We'll just do Mad Axe. What was that? It felt like a nuke. So do I just hit X to you do a critical? Oh shoot, I made a mistake. Okay, down, 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 down. I hope my dog's okay. Come on, doggy. I'm not going to sit here and wait for it, though. Game, <laughs> huh? I like the lighting effect. I can see this guy coming around the corner. Oh! Wow. No, I got to go. Open that. Ooh Come on, get up there. Oh no 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 Well I'm gonna Oh these guys Oh have this fight here. I gotta get over. Oh no, it's a dead end. Okay. This is where it, this is where it comes together. Let's take, uh, what's glowing fungus do? 10 hit points? Nah. We're gonna go for the good old fashioned stim pack. Let's pick a better weapon. Gotta have something good, right? Sledgehammer, hair trigger pistol, double barrel shotgun. I've done this hundreds of Come times. On. Be <laughs> he should be coming around this corner now. close fat man that's a nuke that's a nuke bomb a nuke bomb let's just take all this stuff and we'll figure it out afterwards I can't run that's fine I don't care if I can run but where's my dog did my dog die 
Come on, dog. All right. Let's take a quick pause. I need to pick up my chat and see what it says. There we go. Oh, her night watches brief news brief every night. Thank you. Thank you for that. Uh, so that was that's pretty pretty good moves there on my part, right? I should I be patting myself on the back as much as I seem to be? I think I crushed that. Granted, I lost my dog in the process. Let's see if I can't um, fix some stuff. Let's level up. If I do strength, I should be able to carry more stuff. Let's see. Where is the thing where I can carry more things? I'm going to take strength. Uh, thank you. Wow, this is a little bit more confusing. Now you have all these different pieces of armor. You can't just put it all together. We've got two wedding rings. That's a little weird. T45 right leg. Must be in power armor to do this. A sequin dress. All right. How much overweight am I? Like 20 pounds? All right. Drop, drop. Drop. I want all the power stuff, though. Getting close. That leather chest piece. Get rid of that. This is his whole outfit. Well, that's all garbage, huh? Oh, you're alive. Thank God, dog. We should be getting closer, but I guess I might have gone backwards. Missed something. Oh, but it's up floors. So it's possible that I'm in the right spot, but I just have to consider the fact that I need to get up above on that bridge. That bridge is probably exactly where I gotta be. Raider right there, huh? All right. I need to start really getting better weapons set up. Right beat bumpers. Oh, I guess apparently I did do this. Sharpshooter's hair trigger. Oh, but I've only got one bullet for it, so who needs that? Pipe pistol? No. I must have to be fucking seeing this. All right, let's sneak over there. Can I play one of my songs on the guitar? I will. Once I get to the, you know what? I'm probably just going to get to this next area here. Um, save the game. And then I'll pick up the guitar and I'll, I'll sing a tune. I don't know how the sound's going to be, though. What the hell was that? Oh, did they see me? I mean, they saw me. But did they know what they saw? 
I get in, boys. There's nothing out there. Oops, no, 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 no. Torso. Oh! Oh, I see. That guy's dead. I'll wait over here. Go for that 75% there. I missed him though. Oh! Run, 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 run. Okay. I got him though. Maybe I didn't get him. I'm, I, I'm, I'm gonna get killed. Let's see, do we have a... Oh, come on. Oh, I'm gonna get killed here. Jeez. They're not able to come from behind, are they? I know what to do. I'm gonna go around, but I don't want to use all my AP. You, when you're running, you lose. Oh! Run, 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 run. Okay. Damn it. What's that over there? Is that where I just was earlier? Killed him. Wow. Man, I guess I gotta use another. I gotta use another stim pack. You know what? I'm I'm actually gonna do Nuka Cherry. I'm gonna take uh, Mr. Eating some foods. Oh, I had no idea it was going to fill me up that much. Oh, please. is not easy. I can't seem to quite get on the same ground level as they are. <laughs> Military frequency found. Oh, oh, oh. Where are they shooting me at from? Where are they shooting me at from? Does that even make sense? My brain's not working good. When I'm when I'm my brain starts breaking down. Is this... Oh. Well, I I'm gonna be I'm gonna have too much weight if I'm not careful. The jet will make you jittery. Guess they were right. What the hell was that? Uh oh. Oh no! Oh, I ran right onto it. I wonder how long ago it's gonna make me that save.
Oh, I guess it's here. Well, that sucks. But the good news is I've got a whole different idea on how I want to get to that spot. Um, don't you have an entire week? Uh, well, hello there, RHCP. Um, just playing some Fallout. Oh, pharmacy open. And I don't know if you missed that. I just, like, literally they tossed a grenade at me, and I decided the best idea would be to, to run on top of it before it exploded. Smart, right? I'm going to give it another shot. My hope was that I could get in there, finish this quest real quick, and then I was going to end the stream with uh, playing, some, playing some guitar. At the request of somebody, you know? Oh, I didn't take any of this power armor stuff. It doesn't matter. What I do need, though, is I need the power from the power armor. So let me at least go back and get that part of it. Is it around this corner? No. Yeah, I did... It's... Okay, never mind. They saved it after I... Uh, maybe I saved it. I don't know. Oh, got your attention, didn't I? guys out to us. Okay, there we go. Wow, that was a pretty good shot. If I might say so myself. Hey. No, no, never mind, never mind, never mind. Hey. No, I'm trying to get here. What fell in the water just now? That is disgusting water. So these raiders are the troublemakers. Oh, that's another robot up there. Whoa! And right there. That's an alarm. <laughs> is that a person? Done this hundreds of times. Don't be any different. Oh, I see what's happening. Okay, that was not good. That was not good. The Dark Souls 3 walkthrough? I, I have just talked about this a little bit ago. Um, I don't know about a Dark Souls 3 walkthrough, but I've been in talks with Zach about figuring out how we can do a co-op walkthrough of Dark Souls 1 Remastered. And if we could do that, I think that it's possible that we'd get into the Dark Souls 3 walkthrough. It's just difficult. I don't think it's as fun to do the game as a solo experience. I know it's a single-player game for the most part. But I feel like having a person next to me going through it kind of as a team is, uh, it's good. It's, it, it, it's all about the chemistry, you know? Maybe I'm crazy. Maybe I should just do a solo walkthrough. But I think that it's always better to have a person there next to you. Because there's something special about Dark Souls. People like it more than other games. So I don't want it to be disappointing. I want it to be like a really solid playthrough. I 
don't know if I can get away with this. <laughs> Not what I thought was. Or so is crippled, slowing your action point recovery. Oh, I'm dead. Dead, dead, dead. <sighs> well. Hmm. Should we should we say this is it? This is the last attempt, one last try. Otherwise, I could be dying at this spot all night long. Right, this is it. But I'm gonna play it smarter than usual. Sign of them now. Play engage with me. What the fuck was that? This is gonna be fun. That I'm not playing it smarter than usual. Oh my god! Oh, a workbench. Maybe I can do something with that. All right, all right, all right. Who thinks that they can just have their way with my dog? Well, I guess my dog can defend themselves. Can we use this workstation to craft something? I don't know how to do these things. Yeah, I'm going to exit this station. I wish it was as simple as the old games where it was like, oh, you want to repair? You just have to have two of the same item and then you can just click repair. with no help. It's not that the person's helping me. In fact, you know. You've seen all the trouble Mitch has gotten me into. Sometimes it's even harder to have them helping. Quote, unquote. It's about the chemistry between two people. But, that being said, uh, if you guys really would like to see, I guess I could, I have Dark Souls 3. I could play through Dark Souls 3. Um, I do stream on Twitch usually. Actually, this is the first time I've streamed on, on YouTube in, I don't know, maybe a couple of years. I, I don't even know if I ever streamed on YouTube. Uh, so typically it is Twitch. So go to the Real James Heaney on Twitch and, and subscribe right now. And we'll find out because I've also got it where uh, if you subscribe on Twitch. One thing I like about Twitch is OBS is all um, integrated with it. So that, so that what happens is, well, I don't want to, hold on a second, I'm going to have to. <laughs> Jeez. What's happening here? <clears throat> oh no, this is not the way I want the last life to go. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Nice. I'm 
Oh, see, there it is! I just earned myself a new there it is! I don't know what's happening! I'm gonna get murdered! Thank God. Please be a way out. Oh, I have backed myself into a corner. No! Oh, it hurts. All right, that being said, I told you that was the last try for tonight. Um, let me let me pull the guitar down really quick. I promised a song. I promised a song. Oh, it might be difficult to get that down. Hold on. First, I gotta quit. The desktop. Second thing, second. Let's uh, get this out. Okay. And. Let's see, editor. What's. Duplicate that, okay. Other. Now it's nice and big. We're going to get one more thing up. we got to have a good background. I don't want to just play in front of the black hole behind me. Let's bring in uh, an image. Add new source. Browse. So dumb. So dumb yet great. So there it is. Figured it would be better to play in the forest. Um, I've never used this microphone. Oh, the problem is now I don't have the chat up because my, my thing is there. Let me bring chat now. <clears throat> Here it is. It's a fine mess Mitch got me into. Do I ever see Joe Rogan in L.A.? Well, what's funny is that uh, years ago, Joe Rogan was performing at the Westside Comedy Theater. Uh, I saw him, but I didn't watch him, if that makes any sense. I was, like, seeing him there and walked in and out of the place. Um, yeah, I don't, that's probably the least, th that's not the answer I think you were looking for. Yeah, I mean, so her night says part of the reason she uh, she liked that was because it was fun to have Mitch there while I was playing uh, Dark Souls. I totally agree, which is one of the reasons I haven't done it, d despite the fact that there's the big requests all the time for it. Let's see here. Oh, that blast string does not sound that good. I don't know if you can see this. Let me just see if you can see it or not. Um, my finger, I slammed it in a, in a car door. It's going to look really bad. But uh, oh, let me bring it closer. It's so bad. 
man, it was one of the most painful things I've ever, ever had happen. I didn't cry. I sweat a lot out of my eyes, but it was a hot day that day. Uh, but yeah, I curled up on the floor and I just like, uh, uh. <sighs> and I had an audition for something today that's for, um, I can't say what it was for actually, I almost did, but in it, uh, they didn't ask to see my fingers, but I could tell by the audition that when I have my call back, and I'm going to get the call back, I did good. They're going to ask to see my fingers. And I don't know, maybe I should paint my fingernails like peach? I, there's got to be like a regular color. Like, what do you do to hide the fact that you have a black and blue fingernail? I don't know. Um, let me bring it back to here. <clears throat> so I can see the chat again. You should message LowBroCop on Twitch. He's a small streamer. He does a little podcast where he talks about his favorite movies and acting and such. Oh, that sounds fun. That sounds fun. You play your older songs since you don't make new music. That's sad. You're so talented. Oh, thank you. Uh, the werewolf songs. I'll, I'll play the, the Secret Agent song. It hurts to play, though. My fingernail's pretty, pretty messed up. So my question would be, does, does it sound okay? This is the first time I've used this microphone. It's a wireless mic, but it's certainly supposed to be focused on my voice. So, you know, I don't work at no supermarket. No, I don't work here. I just, uh, I'm undercover right now. So, uh, yeah, I'm sitting at the front of the line for the groceries, but... <clears throat> I don't work at no supermarket I found some evil here and now I've got to stop it I don't get paid six twenty-five. No, I get a million dollars every time I save a life So you and him and all them there Are gonna make me a millionaire Cause I'm a super duper undercover A secret agent Sly spy, I'm a super duper undercover secret agent. Sly spy. You take me for some kind of fool that never even went to school. I went to a secret university, and that's where I picked up my degree in. Government conspiracy Cause I'm a super duper Undercover A secret agent Sly spy I'm a super duper undercover Secret agent Sly spy And then imagine for a moment That this guy is picking up groceries With one of those little laser guns with Beep! Looks like he's ringing up beep beep, but he's not ringing anything up. Beep, blippity pop, booty boop, booty bee. Nah, that's just my tracking device to make sure none of the bad guys can sneak up on me by surprise. Cause I'm a super duper undercover secret agent. Sly spy, I'm a super duper on the cover secret agent. Sly spy, I just bring myself a new phone. Yeah, so there's that song. Mm, I'll play one more. This is the darkest song I've ever written for sure. Tell me if my eyes are red Cause then I won't waste my time lying I'm lying here alone in bed Pretending that I ain't been crying Oh, our story's much worse instead Cause I've been spending all my time dying And I am already half past dead I'm Already half past dead. It's 
been a while since I played this song, so I'm messing up the lyrics a little bit. After I gave all I could give, I found it was easy to forgive, but not as easy to live and let live. Cause after I did give all I gave, I found it bought me one foot in the grave. And now my life can't get much worse, cause even my blessings have become my curse and my heart it is my hearse and it's warming up cause i'm half past dead i'm already half past dead oh lord click click what a shame my revolver's empty again sure i could feel it until it's full and then i finger the trigger and gently pull I'd bide my time and wait until my consciousness begins to spill. I'm a lonely windowsill, but then I'd have just one question for thee. Am I the man in black? Where is he me? I hear his footsteps softly. He promises to carry me gently. Am I the man in black? Or is he me? Um, so I'm going to end the stream. Thank you guys for tuning in. Uh, if this doesn't sound so bad, you know, maybe I could do... <laughs> she can probably hear me now. But if you guys like listening to the live stream music, I might be able to talk my wife into playing music with me sometime soon. And we'll do like a night, uh, a night where we do a jam session and play some music together. She's a lot of fun to play with, but it takes pulling strings and bending arms to get her to join me. Um, but thank you guys for uh, for tuning in, and uh, you will probably this might like all the requests for music uh, uh, inspires me to want to write some more music. So we'll see. Thank you guys for tuning in tonight. Um, please subscribe on Twitch also because I don't know for sure. I might I might just do some other stuff YouTube wise and not game on there. Uh, if you want to see some gaming, Twitch is probably the best place to do it. Later, baby.